I might as well die with dignity. Oh, fuck! This is Game Trooper 1138 and welcome to Resident Evil 2 Deluxe Edition. So I just picked this game up today or tonight, this being January 24th, about to be January 25th. And right now I'm having to decide to play as Leon or Claire. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna flip a coin. If it lands on heads, I'll be Leon. If it lands on tails, I'll play as Claire. So I dropped it. And let me do a redo. I want to try to two face this thing. Caught it. Smack it. And it's heads. Okay. So we're going to play as Leon. Let's see. For players who are unfamiliar with action games, aim assist, recover a certain amount of health automatically. Enemies are a little weaker than normal gameplay mode. For hardcore fans of this series, saving requires an ink ribbon. <laughs> no autosave, stronger enemies. Uh, let's just do standard. There we go. Now, as you may remember from what I said from Resident Evil 7, I have played the second one before, but I was like four or five years old, and I never got past the beginning Look, part. man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? <laughs> oh, no, man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You got to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse, like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. <laughs> I like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. Alright, calm you're down, buddy. Calm down. You're Just, a terrible person. You guys person. stay strong. Okay, don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, they'll sink to pieces. Oh, come on. Just getting good. Oh, boy. This one's not the one that goes to the smack brand. Oh. Yeah. This is where it's going to smack into something and then we get a big fiery ball explosion. Oh god. Okay, did that destroy her brain? I would assume so, but then what again. Do? What am I gonna do? You never nope, it did not. And yet it did not mess up her legs to where she could stand up. Also, I'm just gonna say this as a warning. I I might freak out a little bit and lose control of my own language, so There will be some language in this. Please be 18 years or older to view this, because this is a ready M game, so there's going to be a lot of uh, blood and gore, intense violence, and strong language, not only from the game characters themselves, but from me as well. <laughs> So what my plan is for this, uh, we're going to go through the story as Leon, and then we'll go back through as Claire. That's weird. Okay. 
Something breaking in a gas station is never good, and seeing a trail of blood on the ground is never good. Explore your surroundings. Okay, I'm already doing that. I've kind of figured that out too. Guess we just follow the bloody footprints to the door then. I didn't get Hello? a chance to play the demo, Anybody unfortunately. There? Because my internet sucks. Like it was gonna take this download for the demo 34 hours and I just didn't have the time. Something's not right. Really? What gave you the idea that something's not right? You all right? Don't move. I'll be back for you. You'll probably be turned by then. Got it, all right. Ugh. Hi. Boy, you're dead. Freeze! I'll shoot. Son of a bitch. Oh shit. Okay. If that second shot would have hit. So let's see. Review. It takes three shots in the head to kill him. Are you gonna get up? Please don't get up. I found a key. A well-worn key. Trying to open up the inventory. Matilda. 12 shot capacity, 9mm polymer frame handgun, non-standard issue gun with problems that make it impractical for general for the general public. Okay. No way. This can't I just shot you three times! In the head! Back up! Crying out loud! You need to use an item to unlock this door. Or solve a puzzle. Select the item and then use, I guess, I don't know, use command. Oh. Don't shoot! Get down! Okay, why is that when a one-shot kill? While everyone else is like, I don't know, three, four, five all right? shots? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later when we're safe. Holy shit! Problem. I got one shot. Oh, hi. Come on. Big nose. Get in. Hold on. Welcome to Raccoon City, home of the Umbrella Corporation. 
where we created that zombie on? virus deep on the ground, and then it got Hopefully out. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Okay, I know the Redfield name from Resident here? Evil 7 when you played no. as Chris Redfield. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Zombies. <laughs> Umbrella. They make things so much better. Capcom presents. Okay, this is kind of reminded me of Walking Dead and how it starts off in the beginning. Ah, uh, I should have put Leon in his sheriff outfit. <laughs> that would have been perfect. <laughs> After I heard they were doing a remastered version of Resident Evil 2, after playing some of the other Resident Evil games that I've played, I've been really stoked to play this game. Because like I said, I played this game when I was like four or five years old. I always got stuck on the beginning part because I kept dying. But it was completely different, like that semi-truck with the Attention, tanker crash, and there was a fireball, you got separated. And you didn't have a gun, or at least I didn't. I couldn't figure out how to get a gun. Oh my God, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. And I kept getting stranded by the zombies, yeah, and they kept killing me. What if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. That's Raccoon City. I don't know what the population is in Raccoon City. Looks like we're walking from here. And an old umbrella pretty much put a barrier around the city to where no one can get in or out. Oh. More like running. Yeah, good call. <laughs> Whoa! Oh! You gotta back up! Um, actually... What the? Yep, here comes the semi-truck with the fireball. Holy shit. There, get out. Get yeah. Out now. Holy shit, get out. Hold on! And here comes the fireball. Maybe a little bit too early on the fireball. Yep, there's the fireball. And we're separated. Oh no. There's the fireball. Claire! Claire, are you okay? Where I kept Go dying all the these years it. ago when I would. I'll be there. Oh my God! No! 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 This no! Is no! Out of control. No! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Where do I go? How do you know where to go? That does not help. About this alleyway. This alleyway looks safe. I'm hoping. I'm assuming. Shit. It's everybody. They've all turned. Okay. Now I have gotten <sighs> there it is. much farther Station. than I ever have when I was four or five years old. 
<laughs> Can I? Nope. There's no way to. Vehicle hopping would be a little bit better. They're slow. They're dumb. That's a void. Wasting ammo when possible. Okay, so that's running. Hello? Explore your surroundings. Can I? Costumes has been at. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Costumes. Leon. Uh, <laughs> 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 we, I, I, I got to do this. Okay, let's see. Return the game. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Look at me, I'm Rick. <laughs> Where's Carl? Carl! Hello? Carl! Is here? What's this? Ah, first ice spray. I need that. And now I need ammo. Let's see. Keep. Um... um, I don't like it. Oh, let me guess. This is the tape I can't pry off with my own hand, is it? No, I can't. Trying to figure out how you holster your weapon. So far, nothing is working. Hello? My name's Rick. Like Rick in the game. <laughs> I'm having too much fun with this. Okay, here's. Okay, I heard clapping. Or bare feet. There is too much going on. Wait, is this ammo? Yes, ammo. Let's see. Oh, this is how I can save. Okay. Let's save right quick, just in case something were to happen. Typewriter. Nice. All right. Let's see. Okay. There has to be someone here. Not good. David! Marvin! You there? I found a way out! It's in here! You have to shoot him! Save shoot him in the head! Find that guy. I'm guessing I'm gonna have to go the way where I opened up that door. And this is deluxe weapons. Ah, Samurai Edge Albert model handgun, 15 shot capacity, 9 millimeter handgun based on the design by Albert Wersker himself. This gun has been customized for robust performance. But a move? No, I. I, I Store. Move you here. Okay. We'll see if this bad boy can do any damage. Alright. Of course, the tape that cannot be opened by hand, it's gotta have a knife. They like Resident Evil 7. Let's keep looking around. It's important we explore what is. I cannot open this door. I imagine it probably needs a lock to fit it. What is this? Ooh, more ammo. Okay. Yes. Okay. 
Oh yeah, that's right. It can hold up to 15 shots. So... Four more bullets. We good. Hmm? Oh. Okay, well, I don't know the combination of that. Let's see. What's the touchpad? They can use them at the map is a screen. It's useful for more than just your current location and surroundings. They can also show you any points of interest and items you have found but haven't picked up. Lion statue, yeah, I found that, but I can't do anything because I don't know the combo. It's a combination lock. My name's Rick, I'm looking for my son, Carl. <laughs> oh, herbs. Green herb, we brought those back. Green herb, a... Hey. A green herb native to the Arclay Mountains. It will restore a small amount of health. Okay, it's a good thing I can't open that door. If I can't open it, that means they can't open it, right? I don't know the combo. Hmm. What about this? Guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know, while we are the home of the pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dy dynamic city with a long and rich history of its own. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer, like how Umbrella Corporation brought on the zombie apocalypse that started in this city, and this city is the cause of the zombie apocalypse. Yay! Raccoon City's police station. The building in the center of the town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. Various features, like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall, remind us of a bygone era orphanage. Just a few blocks down from the police station is an orphanage founded and run by the Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from all around the world. But it does not encourage them to buy, not buy, adopt. Sorry, wrong words, because this is Umbrella, where we can buy anything, even children, for our own diabolical experiments. <laughs> okay, I'm freaking myself out now. Okay. Uh huh. No, that did not help. Gave me a pretty good info. I want something out of the snack machine. Give me a soda. I want. What is that? What is that? Coco. Cocoa pa. I want cocoa pa. What is that? Is that like a coconut flavored soda drink? I want cocoa pa. Okay. Okay, I think we've explored all the upstairs. There's just rooms I can't go in, and a safe I can't crack, and whatever this lion statue is hiding. Hmm. Okay, and yet another puzzle. Goddess statue. Taped box. Typewriter. Item box. Okay, that's where I need to go. Let's see, what else? Okay, we got that. Guide pamphlet. Hmm. Okay, I guess we need to go underneath that door I opened up. Hope nothing decided to crawl out, because that was a loud noise. And we all know, zombies love loud noises. So, we must keep calm and DON'T PANIC! Well, this doesn't look good. You better get in there, Ranger Rick! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm making so many jokes. Uh, yeah, okay. What do we got here? Okay, that's water. We're missing a fuse. Okay, that door is locked.
Fuck. Okay. I'm waiting for something to pop out at any moment. You got this. That's right. Self confidence. Just talk to yourself. Tell yourself, you got this. There's nothing scary. There's no such thing as zombies. There's no such thing as zombies. They never existed. Oh, this door opens. Hello? Well, I believe this person here died of uh, anal bleeding. Lots of microphones. I see a red button and I want to push it. Don't you get up. Okay. Uh, that helps. I guess. Wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Cleaning in progress. Wow, that's a lot of cleaning. Oh boy. More dead bodies. I don't like it. Well. That janitor's gonna be pissed when he comes in the mor in the next <laughs> when he comes in in the morning. Oh hello. Who left their medical spray in the toilets? Okay. I can't put two to two together. That's gonna take up a lot of space. This is what happens if you put too much toilet paper in the toilet. Well, I guess if I had to use a bathroom, I'd have to just go in the women's restroom then. That door is suspiciously open. Okay. Jesus. Everything in here dead. I need bolt cutters. They got him. They're, oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. Woo. He's dead. He's dead. Holy crap. Yeah, it's, uh, it's time to go. Ooh, ooh, yeah. Let's see. Uh, officer's notebook. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Got a statue. Three medallions. It looks like it leads the way out. Okay. Ooh! Ooh! Okay. Okay. Let's see. This is how we get the medallions. Okay. The lion statue. Alright. This looks like it's a lion, a plant, and a bird. And then it's some other statue, a uh, woman with a heart, and a uh, unicorn. Okay. Uh -oh. Gotta go. 
go, gotta 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 go. Oh crap! They're everywhere. No! Ow! 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 Out of ammo. This is a dead end. No! 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 no. Oh my God! I am so dead. Wait. Use. There we go. I did not find a fuse. Come on. Oh crap. No, 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 no. I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo. Watch out. Well, that's one way to do it. You're safe. For now. Hi, Rick. my name's Rick. Have you seen my son, Welcome Carl? Right <laughs> Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't... I could... Yeah, I'm the new sheriff in town, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Does anyone know what started this? Not a clue. I was the uh, all you need to know is that this place will eat you virus you that dead. was concocted. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. And uh, I wish I'd come here sooner. Underground facility controlled yeah, no, by no, no, that Umbrella, and it got out, and people started. Okay, Lieutenant. To I'm ready. fight and eat each other. Hopefully, you'll be able to find a way And then it just station. spread. That officer you met earlier, Ellie. like an infection. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. This is good news. We can get you to hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Yeah, it looks like you got a good chunk bitten out of your side there, so... You need this. I can't take it. Stop. Anything. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. Oh, believe me, I don't hesitate. Take it out, or you run. Got it? I'll probably yes, do more running than <laughs> shoot. Because right now I'm currently out of ammo. Is Are those bolt cutters... Please tell me I didn't. Oh, good. Knife. L1 to ready, R2 to slash. Okay, equip on the inventory screen to use. This knife wears down with use and will break when its gauge is depleted. Can we use the counter attack? L1, when you are caught by an enemy, it can only be retrieved once you defeat them. Okay. to use this too many times okay there's one medallion up here so it was uh, lion plant and a bird okay there we go we got the lion medallion let's go ahead and put it down there because I'm gonna have to get two more Okay, there's one. Oh, it's gonna Maybe be. A... It was right. Yeah, but the passage isn't open yet. Okay, so it's gonna be one of those things where we get one piece at a time, and little by little, it's gonna open up. All right. Go over here and save. 
real quick. I'm curious. Could I go back in there if I want? No, it looks like... I know I missed some things. I was scared those zombies were going to get up. But of course, I don't get up until that guy gets cut in half. This is not how I imagined my first day. Carl! I am running out of space. Well, I've got bullets. Ah, oh, this looks wonderful. Carl! Carl! Are you there, Carl? I can't go that way. You dead? Do that. Okay, that one needs a clover key, I guess. Where do I find these keys? Okay. Let's see, sturdy piece of wood that can be used to board up windows. Okay. That'll hold them. I do about this. Well, it's not a prop. It's a problem. It's a problem. It's a problem. It is a problem now. I was going to say, it's not a problem unless it is a problem. Now it's a problem. Shit! God, what do I do now? What do I do now? Oh my god, oh, crap. Oh no. Ah, uh, god, fiddle, dicks. Either you guys got ammo? No. You got ammo? No. Ah, uh, fiddle sticks. Well, crap. Well, I done messed up. Uh, probably should have knifed her in the neck first. And then. Yep, come here. Come here, sweetheart. Can I get that back? That would be enough. Is there 
any ammo I may have overlooked. That would be a no. Holy crap, I'm already sucking at this. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Uh. Ah! How the situation's not gonna resolve itself. I might as well die with dignity. Oh, fuck! I'm out of ammo. Well, hi. Hello. Or I could do that. Just wait right there. As soon as I find ammo. Wait, hold on. I did not notice that. Oh, that's not a good sign. As soon as I find ammo, I will take care of you. Until then, I'm just not going to bother to waste some heals. Any ammo in here? I need ammo. Ammunition. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. You better not be outside this door. I need that knife back. Oh, uh, duh, where'd he go? Is he gonna come outside the door again? Are you dead for real this time? Or are you just playing possum again? I think she's dead. Yep, she's dead. Ammo check, six shots, okay. Alright. Well, that was... hectic and dumb of me. Unfortunately enough, I managed to find ammo. I should have just pushed on ahead. Okay, if there's a path straight ahead where I can just bypass these idiots, then I'm gonna take it. What's this? Record of events. September 25th. I'm gonna assume it's 1998. We're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. And still, September 25th, one of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was a simply a simple, simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. September 26th, a mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it inside, make it safely behind the emergency shutters. But surrounded as we are, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September 27th, there was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. Twelve people died and there is only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray in here. David Ford. Okay. What do we have here? Ah, oh, a map. There we go. Okay. Okay, there's a way through. And... I don't have bolt cutters still. Right, up and over then. I already don't sound good.
more ammo. You're not getting up behind me, are you? Nope, you're dead. Uh, sir, you know you're not supposed to bang on the machine. It's against policy. Sir, if you don't stop that, I will have to give you a fine. Sir. 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 Hey, big boy, I got a chunky treat for you. Can I just simply walk by? Yep. Okay. Ah, crap. You're... Ah, you asshole! Did I get him? Yeah, I got him. Just back away slowly. Okay, this door is locked. Oh. Gunpowder. Uses of gunpowder. Handgun ammo, gunpowder, two of them. Shotgun shells, gunpowder plus high grade gunpowder, which is yellow. Mag ammo, high grade gunpowder, two of them. There's not a lot of ammo left around the station, so make good use of any gunpowder you find. Mm, excuse me. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention when you're combining things or you won't get what you need. Mm, excuse me again, damn. Um, okay, ammo, what is it with me and only getting 11 shots out of this, don't you get up, Oh my god. <laughs> I had to take my earpiece out right quick to make sure I was hearing what I thought I was hearing. I'm hearing the dogs howl outside. Why are the dogs howling? I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I don't like this. Who just grunted? I heard a grunt. I know I heard a grunt. Don't play games with me, Mac. Let's see, Operation Report. September 28, 2.30 a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently, there's a secret tunnel under this place left over from its museum days. I brushed her idea off before, but now... It's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof there's even a tunnel, or that the sewers are infested with zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try to find out what I can about that tunnel. Elliot Edward. Elliot Edward. Rookie's first assignment. Leon S. Kennedy, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desk. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names. But you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Lieutenant Varga. Scroll in a corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Ah, uh, freaking crap. Um, Marcus, David. Ah, 
crap. Um, Come on. I see the initials are to get here to your success is the initials of our of our first names. Well, I knew I heard grunting. Welcome, Leon. Hi. Yeah, I feel so welcome. Hi there. We're going to be partners, right? Yeah, we're going to be good partners. Look at that. I already gave you something to the bottom of my heart. Well, that went better than before. Do I still have a knife? Nope. It's gone. Well, that's just great. Wait, 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 wait. Neil. Okay, we got an N. I have no idea. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, we got a R. N R M. N R M. There's no R. N. Ah, freaking crap. N R. There has to be an M on one of these. N M R. I know there's a guy named David in here. Where's the D? Where's the D? Where's the D? Ah. Uh. Hey, quit playing games with me. Where? Are you the guy? Yep, yeah, you're the guy who's laying down in the office. Ah, man, that gunshot must have woke you up. Hi there, Sleepy. Oh. Okay. That works, too. Okay. Uh, is there a name on this desk? Nope, just some books. No name. So it's these desk. Let's see, Neil, Elliot. So Neil, Elliot, Neil, Elliot. Boom! I knew there had to be a guy named David. Marvin. Rita. And George. Marvin, Rita, and George. Marvin, Rita, George. Oh, high capacity mag. Matilda. It's only good for a Matilda. Okay, well, unfortunately, this is all the time I have for today. Thank you all so much. Oh, hi. Hello. I hope I'm going the right way to go back. Oh, wait. That's right. I can't go back. Well, I'm screwed. Oh, hi. Hello. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I'll try to get us back on this point. I know the combo now because we're going to be going probably starting over where we left off but thank you all so much for watching remember to hit that like holy freaking crap i cannot talk remember to hit that like button drop a comment let me know what you guys think about how i'm doing so far i can already tell you 
I suck. I'm sorry, Carl, but Daddy's not gonna save you tonight. <laughs> and thank you all so much for watching. This has been Game Trooper Woman Three Eight. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.